We were 70% inside the United States when I became CEO. Today we're just massively more global and we, we have to be strong in these industries. We have to be able to get 30 or 40% market share in China in our healthcare business. I would contend it's hard to be focused on getting 40% market share in your healthcare business and still worry about a media enterprise in the US at the same time. Those two tasks maybe were this far apart in the 1980s. They're this far apart in, in, in the 2010s, right? So I, I, I think this notion of being deep, being only as broad as you are deep is the way you have to think about how you run a company today. If you look at some of the things we've done over the last, let's say, five or ten years, I think what we try to do is reflect both where we think markets are going and also what we think our core competency is. And, and my assessment of the world is that we're really in this period of slow growth and volatility. There's just not a lot of tailwind. You have to make your own tailwind. And that as a result, depth matters. So in other words, I think if you look back in the 90s, it wasn't that anybody did anything wrong, but you had so much tailwind you could be broader than you were deep. I think what we've tried to do is narrow our focus as a company to be only those things that had really significant core competency. And so that's kind of led us into being a, a global infrastructure leader. Uh, you know, we think we're playing to the company's strengths, and at the same time we're playing to those things that the world needs, that have some, some robustness and some buoyancy. So that's led us to be more global. It's led us to be more technical. It's, it's led us to exit media, shrink financial services, and be really in those things that, that can play in what we call the GE store, which is you know, technology and globalization and those things that we think are really core to the company. So I think we're a narrower company. We're still huge, but we're, we're a narrower company. We're a deeper company and we're playing into this global infrastructure need, which I think is, maybe it doesn't have a, a robust tailwind every day, but over the long term, I think we're playing into those things that the world needs.